Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to take a look at Notebook LM as well as another tool that helps you work and query and chat with your documents, whether be it a PDF, PPT or any kind of resource that you want to drive knowledge from and you can instead of drawing from the large language models own knowledge, you can take it from the PDF and customize it. First one is pretty common. You might have heard a lot about it. It's called Notebook LM. It's by Google. And its interface is simple. Uh, you just on the left hand side, you just have to upload your documents like a lot of. So here I have uploaded a markdown file with all the tweets of Alex Hamozi and you can ask for advice like. So as you can see, it has I have asked about Instagram. There's no mention of Instagram in the in this resource. So I can ask him how to grow a business and then let's see if it gives me answers. So a lot of things, it, these are taken from the tweets that Alex Hermozzi has shared. So like this, you can query any document, but this, this tool is only limited in terms of functionality. Uh, another tool for, especially for students or office worker is Atlas. Atlas is specialized when it comes to querying your knowledge base. It is geared towards student. It's free to use. But what I have noticed that if even if you are an office worker, you can use this for your advantage. So let's see how it works. So first of all, it on the left hand side, you see there are folders. These are classes, but you can consider it as like a workspace where a common knowledge resides. So I have created something called as cognitive sciences. And uh, here I can put whatever I want related to this one. So maybe I want to do research on this topic. So I'll click on that. And now it's asking me to create chat, but again, you can put click on this one and put your knowledge. So here I can put it from a link or a computer. So here I have added the knowledge base and now I can just ask it. I can click on focus. I, I since I have added two things, I can select this or this here like this. I can ask it a question and it will focus on the main topics from that PDF. Apart from that, you can add members also here. So like this, you can put anything that you want and from the knowledge, you can take it up or from the link. So this one has more options. You can select deselect and create more spaces, which is class. And as soon as you do, it will be more organized. So in terms of UX, this was is was much better. Now, go, now coming back to Notebook LM, one thing that Notebook LM gives you additionally is a cool feature that it creates a podcast from your knowledge base. So if you open this bottom right button and click on this load option, it would load everything that is there in all your documents and create an AI conversation between two fictional AI and it feels very natural. So let's check it out. So it has created a 13 minute podcast and let's check it out. Okay, so today we're diving into the mind of Alex Hormozzi. Sounds intense. It is. Mm -hmm. And you've brought the perfect source material. A whole stack of his tweets. Which is perfect for a deep dive, right? 280 characters of pure business wisdom. Whatever it is. I love that. Okay, so give us an example. What's a tweet that really highlights this power of doing thing? Well, there's one where he talks about avoiding content creation for years. He was worried to just disappear into the void. Which is a valid fear, right? You've so actually, if you see, it's really well articulated and the way they speak, it hardly feels like an AI. So both the tools are great in terms of their own right. Notebook LM allows only 20 sources to be at attached. And whereas Atlas allows you to attach unlimited knowledge bases and that too, you can organize in between classes and everything. And in terms of retrieval, it is said that Atlas is more pinpointed because it is geared more towards uh, giving answers in the exam. So if you are writing, if you are, if you work in office and you want concise to the point and not very creative, but a bit of a fact based answers, you have to leverage at last. But if you want more on the creative side and you still want to search a database and chat with a PDF notebook, LM is your friend. And also there's a cool feature for podcast that you can share with your friend. So that's it for this video. I will see you in the next one.